Well, it's the latest issue of Out and About magazine, and it's now available. And we have Mary Allen Miller here with us this morning to give us a little preview of what we can expect in this month's edition of Out and About, which you guys always are. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. It's a pleasure to be here. I'm representing Ron Scalf today. Yeah. And a fun fall issue, all kinds of things in this edition. It is. Let's start with your article. What'd you do this okay, time? Okay, well, mine was actually a really neat opportunity where I got to do a go-to meeting uh, call with a client who was not in this area, and she was re entering the workforce and she wanted to know some tips about social media when you're coming back into the yeah, workforce it's mm -hmm. so important and it, it changes is. all the time it is so we talked about hashtags you all were talking about 911 so yes. the remembering 911 hashtag big today we talked about LinkedIn LinkedIn is huge when you're re-entering as a business professional yeah. or as someone getting ready to enter the workforce I urge college students all the time be on LinkedIn that's where the business yeah. professionals are we talked about Twitter and the importance of keeping up with Twitter and the tools that you can use to keep up with Twitter. I know when I'm at home, I always have TweetDeck on my desktop, uh, so yeah. and I'm working on my laptop so that I can keep track of the different lists that I, I have. I mean, it's mm -hmm. overwhelming. It's a full-time job keeping up with your social media it sometimes. Can be. Yeah. It can be. Mm. And then, of course, Instagram. One thing I've watched that's been really fun is watching my 12-year-old use Instagram in yeah. a way that's completely different from the way we adults use it. A 10-year-old <laughs> is on it, too, and I'm like, I mean, Thank we you. have to stop for a picture of everything. Thing, you know well and they have these amazing apps where they're flying backwards and shooting basketballs backwards and things that we don't uh, yeah. ways that we don't use it you know he he mentions to me that three of his friends all showed him his homework that night and I'm like okay oh yeah they direct messaged me on Instagram, Instagram. <laughs> You're like, of course it's so different so it's fun to see how they're how they're embracing and using social media channels and technology in different ways so it's yeah. fun to see the next generation coming up. But and out and about, here we are. Let's talk speaking, about the rest. Yeah, speaking of back to school, we've got yes. Toby who does our uh, wonderful movies. And great. he did some fun back to school type he movies. Did. Karate some of kid. them, which I love. Yeah, Ferris Bueller's <laughs> Day Off. Yes. But the interesting one that I wanted to ask Toby about was Mean Girls down here. Yeah, mm -hmm. I wondered th that myself. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, there you go. Mean Girls. I did like Mean Girls. He's got Grease on there. Line Grease. Some and great music. Yeah, karate Kid. <laughs> so some good information on some fun old movies, mm -hmm. which especially with kids, it's fun to go back and watch those movies that came right. out in the 80s and 90s, and they right. have that new appreciation for them, so right. it's a lot of fun. And everybody looks for uh, Caught Out and About. Yes, so you, yes, and there you all caught. are. caught. You got caught. Yes. Which, by the way, that was when we took first place in the cow milking contest. Mm -hmm. Congratulations. Anything, I remember that. Yes. Anybody can milk it. It's the two of us. <laughs> yes, that is so true. Uh, and then, of mm. course, the WJHL when we did the uh, ice bucket challenge. And you got yours. You got a full page in there. Yes. yes. We were talking about the Making Strides Against Breast Cancer, and it's such an important walk coming up mm -hmm. October 26th. And you guys were nice enough to let us put one of our faces of breast cancer. And a, a local girl, mm -hmm. wonderful woman, mm -hmm. um, battled breast cancer. Cancer, and uh, here's her story and why it's important to support the American Cancer Society and the local program. So we thank you so much for oh, that. Oh, it's, it's certainly our pleasure. And then you have the fantastic golf column. If anybody's interested yes, in golf, that. some really good tips on putting there. I learned a lot reading that column. Really? <laughs> I, I can only hope it'll help my game. <laughs> are you? Are you so you're a big golfer? Uh, used to be. Don't no. play as much anymore. But uh, I need to get well, back out there again and hard, the time. use those tips. I, that's holes. exactly right. I usually do three every other week, and then. You <laughs> <laughs> you know, I need six months of golf. <laughs> yeah. Well, okay. either pick up one of these or you can go to outandaboutmagazine.com and read it online. Thank Thanks you. So Thank much. you. Good to have you on the show. We're going to take here. a break. Hey, when we come back, we're all about tailgating. We were mm -hmm. speaking about fall. We've got Liz Bouchong over there in our kitchen, and mm. she's going to be giving us some great Ooh, recipes good. for, yeah, mm, Cracker Jack. She's making mm. them from scratch.